Hello, thanks for joining me for another review. Today I bring you flowers in the form of a bouquet from Polly's Brew Co in Mould, Flinchy in North Wales and this is their bouquet IPA coming in at 6.3% ABV. Lovely looking can then. Uh, there you go. So, a bit of spec on this one then. So it's a 440ml can then. It's brewed with the hops are Comet and Mosaic. Um, malts are extra pale oats and wheat and the yeast is USO5 2.8 UK units and this was canned on the 3rd of March of 2020 best before the 3rd of September 2020 so let's crack into this then I purchased one at the Little Swift in Margate their home delivery service so I'm very, very fortunate to have <coughs> Uh, a place like that, kind of close by. Uh, so yeah, beer in a glass. I've had uh, one beer, a single hop beer with Comet in, in the last few months, funnily enough, but we'll get into that in a sec. So it's uh, uh, just about half finger of white head. Um, give this a little tap to get them bubbles off. It is a clean glass. But yeah, it's not um, crazy in, in the haze, it's sort of a medium haze if you like. Um, there is a little bit of, uh, you can see through the beer, going look, looking up sort of that way to uh, the top of the head. So there is a little bit of clarity there, but yeah, look, looks quite nice in the glass, kind of a, a light orange if you like. Um, so yeah, let's get an aroma then. Okay, very sort of a... Uh, It's like um, a light, I'm getting a bit of kind of lychee or something, maybe a bit of melon. Slightly floral, sorry about the uh, bouquet reference there, but yeah, it's that sort of slight kind of pear drops. Slightly sweet. Let's give it a try. Interesting aroma. Cheers. Yeah, this one definitely a little bit. Um, yeah, lemon zest, lemon pith, but then it's got a slight kind of sweet kind of edge to the beer. Very light, very light. Hmm. Very approachable, low bitterness. Lovely looking can, wonderful stuff. Uh, other information here, so yeah, Mould Flinch here, which is I think North Wales. Um, Pretty cool. Uh, fresh, modern and vibrant beers produced with passion from Polly's uh, Old Farm in the hometown of Mould, North Wales. There we go. Polly's Brew dot, dot co. I guess it's dot co or dot uk. I will find out. But all the information will be down below to contact them or whatever. I'm pretty, pretty sure they've got an online website as well. Hmm. It's, it, there is a sweetness there that kind of I don't know it's there there is a malt kind of aspect to it which is what it is it's that sweetness from the malts but not in a, a kind of unpleasant way it's more it's giving me a, a kind of a a slight confectionery sort of vibe to the malts I mean this US what is it US 05 I think I've had one or two beers with that malt um, or fermented, yeah, clean fermented. That's what it's saying with US so far for an awesome, crisp, yeah, crisp and balanced IPA. Mm. 
it's just different it's not one of them it's almost a slight not funk because that would be like but there is a, a very kind of nice grassiness to it the kind of hop oils again I keep recently I've been saying it a lot in, in some of these beers but this is really enjoyable stuff um, for sure I'll go into the uh, comments and it will kind of link me up to what I was going to say at the beginning of the review so it says sometimes um, doing things simple is the best way to go about things when it comes to beer absolutely drinking it is pretty simple and easy um, one of our brewing heroes the Colonel so out of Bermondsey in London which is where I had that single hopped uh, Comet uh, beer February February beginning of the year something like that that was awesome um, as they mentioned the brewery I'm going to mention as well um, so yeah uh, Bo Bouquet is an unashamedly tribute to the masters of simplicity uh, with an easy going hot bill of new school mega hop Comet and Mosaic. Comet hops, what I, what I was told by one of the guys at Com uh, uh, one of the guys at Comet, um, one of the guys at um, the Colonel, said it's a very hard hop to come by, and there's not very many beers that have been brewed with solely single hop Comet. So yeah, so it's really cool to actually try another beer with with that in from Polly's Brew, of course. I'm, I mentioned that Colonel Brewery a lot because they did. So in in the actual description of this beer, so I, I wouldn't normally, but um, but yeah, um, yeah, and then clean fermented with 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 the USO five as already said, uh, crisp balance IPA, and, it, and that's exactly what it is. It's um, it's an easy drinking beer without being crazy. Uh, it's more of a subtle, light. different kind of uh, flavour profile from what I'm used to but not in a bad way just but it's different I've, I'll just leave it at that really but in a good way of course but but yeah it's just a different approach you know with with, with my taste buds at least so uh, a very nice beer indeed um, in terms of rating them for me on this one I, I, I I mean, yeah, I've had better from from Polly's Brew Co for sure. It's certainly in the last sort of few months, um, but it's still a, a pleasant beer. Um, I'll give this beer a seven and a half out of ten, so I think that's fair. So, a a three point seven five on the untapped scale. Over to untapped, then it's had seven hundred and forty two total check ins, three hundred and forty eight in the last thirty days. So that kind of gives you an idea of. So it's probably a couple of months old or so, as as the canning would suggest, of course. Um, yeah, since the, the 3rd of March. So it's had 682 total ratings then, it's coming in at 4.05, so that's, that's, a, that's, a, that's a pretty big score um, for, for that amount of ratings, which is quite low compared to some, but yeah, pretty good, pretty solid. But I'm giving, for me personally, I'm giving this a 3.75. Um, if I was a, a, an untapped kind of... Um, member then I'd probably give this a 3.8 something like that um, but yeah nice beer if you see it around um, it's been around for a couple of months or so but yeah there you go bouquet from uh, Polly's Bruco out of North Wales cool thanks for watching then uh, check out all the information down below um, I always put the commercial description watch I've read you and all other bits and bats and yeah hope that's uh, handy for you to read and all that sort of stuff so anyway thanks for watching keep safe and i'll see you on the next one cheers <laughs>